Hi, I am Isaac and welcome to Wanderers Clubhouse. So this week we have the NRL Telstra Premiership Round 1 and we have so many exciting clashes and the first one we have is the South Sydney Rabbitohs up against the Melbourne Storm up at Amy Park in Melbourne. South Sydney have never won up there and they are looking to break the curse but I'm not sure how that's going to happen with the side that Melbourne have. They have Ryan Pappenhausen, Cameron Munster, Josh Adokar and many others. But the South Sydney Rabbitohs have Latrell Mitchell, Alex Johnston, Cody Walker and Damian Cook. They're going to be hard to beat. So I don't know who I'm going to tip in this match, but if I'm going to tip someone, I think I'm going to have to go with the draw in this game. Because I have absolutely no idea who's going to win this game due to the fact that both teams have one of the best records playing each other. And we have the next game on Friday night, the early game. Newcastle Knights are versing the Canterbury Bankstown Bulldogs. While the Bulldogs have been the most talked about team in the off season, with signing Nick Kotrick and Kyle Flanagan and many others. But the Newcastle Knights have Caelan Ponga missing, but the massive signing of Tyson Frizzell. So you have no idea who's gonna win this game again. But if I'm gonna have to tip someone, I think I might have to go with an upset here. I think the Dogs might beat the Knights, but you never know. And we have the late game in Brisbane. Brisbane Broncos versus the Parramatta Eels. Now, Brisbane Broncos will not play with Payne Haas due to a suspension, and the Parramatta Eels have everybody fit and ready to go, and I reckon Parramatta will beat them by a lot. And we've got the early game on Saturday. It's a three games, and the first game is the Warriors versus the Titans. Now, the Titans are another team that has been talked about a lot in the off-season, with David Fafita joining their team, Tino Fasua Malaawi from Melbourne Storm. And can I tell you, the Warriors, they have had a massive signing, a front rower from South Sydney Rabbitohs in Bailey Siren. Now, guys, I just have to say, I've got no idea who's gonna win this game again. And that's probably gonna be my, my result for the whole entire round. But if I'm gonna have to p predict someone here, I think the Gold Coast Titans have too much of a strong side for the Warriors to beat them, but you never know. And in our next game, we have the Red Hot Chookies up against the Manly Sea Eagles. Now Manly, well, they had a trial match against the West Tigers and the West Tigers beat them 56 to 16, so you never know what's going to happen. But I'm just predicting that East will win and it will be a blowout for sure. And in the late game, up at the foot of the mountains, I'm sure everybody will be at that game, Panthers versus Cowboys. Now, Panthers were one game short of winning the comp, and while they made the grand final, they did everything they could, but they just weren't good enough in the end. They played the Melbourne Storm, but this year they're looking to win it again. And I just think Panthers are gonna win it by a lot, a massive margin. And here we go, we're up at the nation's capital for the West Tigers up against the Canberra Raiders. Now, can I tell you, Mal Meninga will be pumped for this game as well as Ricky Stewart's Raiders and Madge's West Tigers. They've got so many new players, the West Tigers as well as the Raiders. I'm gonna have to predict the Raiders to win this game. And in our late game, in the last game of the round, up at Nestrad and Jubilee Oval, we got the St. George Illawarra Dragons up against the Sharkies. Now the Sharks and Dragons are two teams that well, are both predicted to become in the bottom eight of the ladder, but you never know, rugby league is a different game. My game of the round, the Rabbitohs versus Storm, I think that most people, even if they can't watch it, they're gonna definitely pay for that game, and even many will go to that game. Now back onto the Sharks versus Dragons game, I just think the Sharks will get them in this, but I reckon the, the closest the game will be probably two points decided in it. And if, the, if they don't win at the Sharks, then we'll go to the Dragons. And thank you very much for your time and I hope you guys will enjoy round one.